dev, you experience many hardships, and one is studio crashing and not having a good computer to develop on. Well, that's where I come in. I know tons about computers and have had pretty much everything from the very worst to the very best computers that you can think of. So I know exactly the computer you should get as a new developer because I've worked on every single kind of computer. And if you can't afford it, still watch because once you make more Robux and dev exit for money, you'll know what to get. I'm going to link all the computers below. Let's start with number five. This is a second-hand computer from Craigslist or OfferUp or Facebook Marketplace, the cheapest option for the best power that you can get for the lowest price. So you can get a second-hand computer. You want to go for preferably a gaming desktop, and this would be the lowest price thing that you can get. So look for something that has hardware from around 2015-ish or newer. And the reason why is because this is the oldest time when hardware is still actually decently fast and will last lasts you quite a while developing and will work for most games that you're working on. I also recommend highly researching the graphics card and processor inside each computer that you are looking at so that you can make sure that it is a good computer. You don't want to get something that's trash, so make sure you're informed, watch videos on it, watch some tests on some games that you like, and see if it works. But yeah, secondhand, really underrated, and you can find really good stuff secondhand or even refurbished. Avoid stuff that doesn't have a dedicated graphics card because that'll be slow. All right, number four, a secondhand gaming laptop. This is still going off the secondhand thing, but the reason why a gaming laptop can be better is because you can take it with you and develop in more places. And also, gaming laptops are getting faster and faster, and there's tons on the market, and it's not even necessary to really have a desktop anymore. I use my laptop more than my desktop, as I'm always going places, and now I can work more wherever I want, so I can get more videos out for you guys. I recommend looking for some Thing from at least around 2017 or newer and make sure that it also has a dedicated graphics card and at least a six core processor these will ensure that you get a good laptop that will work for everything that you want to do as a developer all right number three is a good gaming computer brand new you can buy parts individually and build your own if you want to be advanced with this or you can just buy one from the description of a few good choices that I have picked out my personal gaming computer that you'll see on screen is what I use to record my videos and it's also my main desktop I use when I'm sitting down and using Roblox Studio. It's insanely fast and very performant but it is not portable of course so I would still recommend for most developers to get a laptop for their first computer but this is still very good and definitely better than having a secondhand gaming laptop or a secondhand computer for the lower pricing options. If you find something real good it can still be better than a brand new thing just so you know. All right, number two, this is a MacBook Pro 14 inch. This is actually another computer I have, and this is what I use for editing, writing this very video plan, which you'll see on screen, and uh, a lot of other things. This is one of the fastest computers I've ever used, and it has insane battery life that is the longest lasting battery life I've ever seen on a laptop. Absolutely insane, and definitely really, really good as a development computer. I mean, also the MacBook Air, is plenty fast and would probably work well, but the MacBook Pro is just a more solid computer that'll last you longer. It has a better screen, a lot of other things which make it more worth it, but it is very expensive. And that leads me on to the next one, which is the best value, the best choice out of all of these, in my opinion, for most developers. And number one is the M2 Mac Mini. This is a new Mac that just released by Apple and it is very fast. And this is way worth it for every developer because it's only 600 bucks and it has insane performance bro this would be a great choice for any developer starting out and i might even get one on second hand maybe not i have too many computers <laughs> but the m2 mac mini will work for everything you want to do and it is absolutely one of the best computers ever made because it's very fast and it is going to be very good for most development tasks and the m2 is a very fast chip and 600 dollars for a computer this fast is absolutely insane definitely the best option for price and for power coming all together in 
under one thing. So yeah, make sure to click the link in the description for the computer you want to get. Please use those links because it does support the channel if you use it and buy something from there. But yeah, hope this helps. And if you still need to make money to get a PC, I am sure you can do it because I have a solution. Click the video on screen to learn how to start making Robux so that you can cash it out and start making money off your Roblox development work by taking commissions and getting paid for your work. See you there and thanks for watching.